So I don't really know if you guys knew this about Claudette, but pretty much she was crazy into science when she was in high school. So I don't really know if the school saw that as a gift from her, uh, but they pretty much offered her a scholarship to college, which she took. And uh, leading more towards the future, when she was driving home from college, pretty much I think was on a bus, she decided to take a walk in the woods. And... Uh, <laughs> Don't know why she would, but that's pretty much enough said, as you guys can probably tell, she got lost in the entity. That's pretty much her life. Pretty much leads up to her just getting lost. But as you can see, we're gonna be playing her today, and uh, we got her three core perks. We got her self-care, her botany, and her empathy. So, um, we're gonna be bringing a med kit with these, because you guys can probably tell due to her perks. She's pretty much a medic, right? So she pretty much goes around, heals people. There might be more to that, but we're gonna try to stick to that during this game. Um, but with that being said, I'll see you guys in game. Ooh, Lampkin Lane. I haven't been on this map for a while. I don't have balanced landing, though. This is a terrible time to give me this map game, goddammit. Uh, we're gonna go find a generator. We're just gonna go do some janaletas. Because as I said before the game started, I kind of want to be the medic of this game. I kind of want to run around and find people after they've been downed. I don't really want to be the one going down myself. Still kind of sucks I don't have a fucking insta heal. Goddammit. I don't know why I don't have one of those. Uh, but either way... We're gonna try to get all these gens done and get out of this goddamn map. He's got ruins, Bill. He's got ruins. Yeah, you know that too. He's like, what the fuck? What are we doing? Getting back on the gen. Alright, I respect. Let's get this shit done then. We tapping through it? Is this really how people actually deal with ruins these days? Oh shit, someone's injured. Alright, I'll see you later, Bill. I got my excuse to leave. Fuck that. We're gonna have to go find that later unless someone's already on the totem hunt. This is goddamn Nia getting chased. Is she getting chased by a Michael? She's gotta be getting chased by Michael. What are you getting chased by? You're just running away obliviously. She threw that pal down with nothing fucking behind. I swear to God. Let me touch that ass. I'm gonna save my med kit, considering she's not getting chased. I got my botany, so that's why the bar is yellow. Because it increased the heal speed. You gonna get on that totem? Alright, add a girl. Wouldn't have expected any less from ya. Yo, when you're done that shit, you wanna come over and give uh, Papa John a hand on this Janaleta that still has ruins? For God's sake. Yeah. Oh, urban evasion activate. Let's fucking go. Yo, you wanna come this way? Oh, for fuck's sake. Bill, what did you do? Who the f What is the killer? Oh, it is a Michael. Okay, it's fucking going insane for a second. Yo, come here. Come here. Come here, come here. Oh, there's the- there's the totem! I ran straight by, he's like, fuck, this is mine. This is out of mine. Oh, you want me to get it? Okay. Probably gonna get fucking grabbed. This is either a death trap, or this Bill's just very kind. Stitching up his fucking stomach over there. Yo, Bill, I got you after this. Alright, buddy. Alright, alright. Fuck the ruins. Yo, come here. Oh, God! Oh, God! <laughs> That's kind of terrifying. I don't usually get scared by the goddamn Michael himself. Where the fuck is he? Oh, for fuck's sake. No, please, no. Oh, my God. This is a fucking pallet over here. Okay, we're Gucci. We're Gucci. Look at that boosted fucking pallet. I'm gonna get the fuck away from this guy. Does he have scratched mirror? Or whatever that add-on is with fucking monitor and abuse? If it's gonna be one of these games, I don't know how enjoyable this is gonna be. But he's back on another person. Okay, alright. Let's heal quickly. Are these two just having a fucking orgy over there? I swear to god, if this guy gives up. Every time I try to attempt making one of these videos, they just... Resort to fucking farming. He is stalking. Oh, no. Okay. No. Yeah. yeah he's definitely got scratched mirror It's definitely one of these Michaels. I don't really know what's gonna happen this game. <laughs> if he's gonna keep on following me I have a feeling this is one of my friends. I really hope it isn't. I know one of my friends that does this all the time. Move! You fat asses! Okay, he swung at the window. This man. Look at this Nia. Look at this fucking Nia. You see this Nia? You see this goddamn Nia, Nia run? This is a P3 Nia. Oh my fucking god. Respect the pallet, good sir! God damn it. How's it going, Nia? Protect me. Oh my god. This is just depressing at this point, Michael. For fuck's sake. Oh, for God's sake. No, please no. You'll never expect it. Alright, let's go over to this pallet over here. The fucking window juke, whatever you want to call that shit, always works on Michaels if there's no collision. Like, sometimes they'll assume that that's what you're doing, but, uh, in most cases, you just run through them and they're like, what the fuck just happened? How dare you run through my body like I'm a goddamn ghost? That's what happens when you stalk as Michael, his collision is completely gone. Because if, if a survivor gets trapped in the corner, uh, while the Michael is stalking him, it's, it's pretty much just game over for the, uh, survivor. Is he giving up with life? You done? Is this how the game is gonna go? 
Oh, oh shit. Oh, he's moonwalking his way over here. How's it going? <laughs> There's gotta be another one of these goddamn games. Why? You got fucking insidious? Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, you should- you should kill me. Put me on that goddamn hook. Let's go. Don't really find joy in, uh, in farming. Can you put me on the goddamn hook? Thank you. Please don't save me right off the bat. No, Nia, Nia, fuck no. If you fu- Please. Put me on the fucking hook! I wanna die! Dude, legit. I don't wanna farm. Come on. No. Come on. Thank you. Please, no! No! Hit me. Hit. Me! Alright, alright, you know what? Thank, okay. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To penetrate my ass for the third time, we can get this over with. F thank. <sighs> yes. Come on. Let's get it over with. Please. Please! Yes. Thank you. Oh! We're gonna try this one more time. Cause <laughs> that didn't go the way I was planning. It kinda sucks that, you know. You have like a funny game, right? But then it just turns into that. Like, I understand that people like to meme in this game, and I do it myself as killer, but like, there was just really no attempt in order to like, try to survive. It just pretty much turns into a point fest. It just doesn't... I... I don't know. I don't know. It's not what we're going for right now. Let's just say that. Well... I guess... I guess we can't complain. We're in a fucking hospital. And we're the goddamn nurse, or... I don't, I don't even know, the paramedic. Something like this, we got a fucking med kit in our hand. So, this is pretty suiting. How's it going, Dwight? How you doing? Uh, uh, okay, I, I'm good. But thank you. Wait, where'd he even go? What the fuck? He just Houdini'd out of here. What the fuck? Dwight! Where'd he go? How's he going, Fang? This is her hospital as well. We got two nurses in here. If anything, it's gonna be a goddamn doctor. And uh, we only have three survivors. Oh, look at that. That's delightful as fuck. Alright, <laughs> welcome. Oh, you got a med kit as well. Look at this shit. Thank you. Alright, take, yeah, thank you. Okay, just a yellow one. I don't even know where this killer is. He hasn't even shown himself yet. If anything, uh, if anything, it's another goddamn Michael. Activate Urban Evasion. I know you got it, buddy. Everyone's got it these days. It's a goddamn crutch. Goddamn crutches. Fuck the self curve. We, we resorting to Urban Evasion now, boys. Wait, Dwight, he's coming. Dwight, he's coming. Gotta walk away from this shit. Oh, never mind. Never mind, he's coming back. He's coming back. That's a spook. I got spooked by that. Don't know about you. You gotta activate uh, activate that stealth. The second you hear that heartbeat, you just gotta make sure that uh, you crouch. Preferably, preferably in a uh, nice little patch of grass right here, as you guys can see. Cause he'll never see you if you're in your in your original biome. Where the fuck did he go? Oh, Jesus, fuck! No, 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 no! You didn't hear that? Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> How did I did not get the prompt to deactivate it. God damn! That is something I did not expect one bit. Holy fuck, alright, alright. Urban evasion activate, boys, as I said. Let's get our way over here just slowly, slowly but steadily. I'll need the, uh, I'll need the nurse to grasp my armpits. The nurse to grasp the nurse. Here at the hospital, we have our nurse's backs. We're here for each other, even though the fucking buff trapper over here is spreading his fucking AIDS. God damn it, Fangman. We got this white, I believe. Oh my fucking god. Trap central, I tell ye. I tell ye what? Just deactivate this shit quickly. There we go. Actually, I should have pulled down the pallet, or dropped it down, and then I uh, vaulted it, so when the trapper breaks it, he has to pick it up. And uh, if he already has a trap in his hand, then he can't pick it up. Oh, sorry, you wanna heal me? Thank you. Detective Galvin on the case. Thank you, kind sir. You wanna go save our, uh, save our fangman? Where's the trapper? This goddamn trapper. God, I fucking- Oh, no! Fucking save you fucking quickly. That was really fast. Oh, God. God, knowing this guy's probably got like another 500 traps placed somewhere. This man knows what he's doing. On my ash hole. He's going, Fangman. Did he lose me? Nope. Nope. He, he's on the Fangman now. He's trying to slap her. He's got this. I believe. She. She's got this. Look at that pallet play. Look at that pallet stun. Keep on running. I'll take the aggro off you, buddy. Come on, slap my ass. There we go. Take him up for the team. Oh god. Maybe a bit too much for the team. Oh, can I not make it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you. Please leave now. I'm just an innocent Claudette who wants to help her fellow Fangmen. Look at me camping these pallets. Look at me camping these pallets. What a toxic Claudette. 
No! So many goddamn traps! Wait, what is he trying to do? Alright, alright, I understand. God damn. First walk into that goddamn grass trap, and now... <sighs> now we're getting penetrated for the second time. If you, uh... Okay. I guess we're doing this. This guy likes to mine game. On a very, very unsafe pallet, so I don't really wanna... I don't really wanna stay near these ones. I don't even know if I can heal myself fully with this medkit. I can't go down again. I get down one more time and it's fucking game over. We're not escaping our own goddamn hospital. Is he over here? Oh, wait, the Fang Min's got leader. I'm like, oh my god. I'm sorry, Dwight. Yo, no, no, no. <laughs> Has he already been hooked? He's already been hooked. I mean, like, twice. I don't think he's dead. Oh. The fuck? Why? Why? Why is there so many goddamn farmers? This ain't Farmville. See, like, okay, I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna stand in front of him. Let's see if he wants me to save him. Is this the plan? Is this the goddamn plan? Like, I understand he would've killed me. Like, this guy was doing pretty fucking good. Yeah, he might just kill me right here. But, like, why? It just completely takes the fun out of it. I'd rather die to someone that outplays me than just fucking have a free win and just farm. I don't- I don't want the blood points. I don't, like, yes, I need them, but I don't- No! Just- just here. Come here. Come here. Pretend I'm the pallet, alright? Smack me. For fuck's sake, come over here. Let's put me on the goddamn hook. I don't want to deep hit myself, so I'd rather take a beating. Thank you. Thank you very much. And, uh, put me on the hook. Oh my god. Fangman, please don't throw it down. Oh boy. Trapper, look, look, I'm gonna stand here, so you can't fucking break it or move, okay? You're gonna have to hit me. And then you're gonna have to pick me up. Pick me up. And now you're gonna put me on the hook. And then we can all be happy. You can get your fucking pip or whatever the fuck you were going for. I swear to god. And this is what we're doing. Alright. I just... I don't really know what to do at this point. Like, like, what do we do here? We got a trapper fucking placing traps like 24-7. We got a fangman about to die. He's gonna step in his trap and fucking get me off off his shoulders. Thank you very much. I'm gonna sing, I'm gonna save the fangman. My points, Dwight, even though it doesn't matter. Because I'm gonna DC. I don't I don't wanna just leave the match like that. I don't really wanna just take it. Just walk out. There's really no point to that. A lot of people take it. It's like, you know, there's really no point harm. Like, the only person that's gonna suffer from this is the trapper. But I've had a few games like this already. Every time I try to get a video for you guys on Claudette, I've had like a doctor, a fucking Michael, the other one. Goddamn trapper, goddamn huntress. So many goddamn people just wanna farm these days. And uh, yeah, it can definitely be, you know, a good resort for fucking blood points, but it's just something you don't wanna do. You just wanna play the game legit. Or, you know, at least try. At least go for the objective, even though I never do it, so look at me talking. But, uh, I'm not gonna try again. I'm just gonna wait a few days, go to Jake. I'm kinda sad that this is how it had to turn out for Claudette, but... Hopefully you guys enjoyed, no matter what. We ran them around for a tiny bit, but... <sighs> what can you do? What can you do? It's goddamn dead by daylight. Must have been to 11 when the world ended. At least it felt like it at the time. Teenage years make a heartbreak worse, plus a lot was going on. Couldn't stop it at the time, Dad tried to flip the house. Funny that it all ended upside down. Known for being optimistic, started feeling different, couldn't fix it, started writing lyrics all because nobody tried to.